Hello, welcome to this video tutorial on how to match names that are not spelled exactly the same or entries that you want to, you will have used VLOOKUP for, but then because the spellings are not similar, you know, then VLOOKUP won't work. So see, here I have a table of account manager, the clients, the manage, the sales figure, and a separate table of, you know, account managers, again, the sales, but this here, the targets are also included. So how do you you know, merge these two tables, you know. Normally you would use VLOOKUP, but VLOOKUP won't work here, why? Because you'll see Jide Oshikoya here, it's obviously Oshikoya Jide here, but VLOOKUP won't know that. And this is a common uh, situation I encounter people face and they ask me how to go about it. Microsoft has a very nifty tool specifically built for this kind of situation. The tool is called Fuzzy Lookup, right? So you just need to go and install it. You can go search for fuzzy lookup adding for Excel, you know, on Google, and then you see this site, and then you you download it. So when you're done installing, you will see it as one of your menu items in your Excel, right? So one main thing to do before we'll be able to use the fuzzy lookup, huh? the thing is you need to convert the tables to tables in excel which is very straightforward you know under your home menu format as table and then you know we do it also for the second one and it's always good i think it's even compulsory that the two tables should be on the same sheets you know side by side okay so in case your tables are in separate sheets or separate workbook you might have to copy one into where the other is okay so now that i'm done making the two uh, tables formatted as table i go to fuzzy lookup i click on fuzzy lookup right and uh, normally it, it detects the tables right so the table one table two yeah it's done that normally detects it uh, and so you only need to select where you want the results to be so i'm selecting that i want the result to be here i come here and then i pick the fields that i want to do the make the matching by so i want to match by the account manager name account manager name and here you select the tables you want in your final result table right uh, for now i'm going to leave the default which includes all of the fields in the two tables right and then here you set the number of matches i'm not too familiar with what that means but this similarity threshold right you can set you know whether you want it to be extremely similar before it matches them or you leave it as the figure it was before the default works well by the way it will always show you the percentage similarity right so once you're done setting this you know once again you select where you want the result to be and you click on go and then instantly it does its own magic right so see it's done and let's check it out right it's done matching the fields and if you notice you'll see that the ones that the names were not even spelled exactly the same, right? Like Jide Oshikoya or Shikoya Jide, it matched them correctly, right? And so this is the tool you will need to use when you have a situation like this. So thank you and make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel.